Jean-Charles de Bardard was a French mathematician and military engineer. He achieved the rank of capitaine de vaisseau in the French Navy and participated to the U.S. War of Independence. He investigated the flow through orifices and developed the Borda mouthpiece. During the French Revolution, he worked on the metric system with Joseph Louis Lagrange and Pierre Simon Laplace. Orifice flow were used as water clock called Clepsigra in ancient Babylon and Egypt as well as in part of Africa and some North American Indians. They were used up to the 16th century. Today, the sun glass used the same principle with granular material. Orifices and nozzles are used also as measuring discharges. In his study of orifice flow, Jean-Charles de Borda made a significant contribution by introducing the concept of streamlines and by developing the border mouthpiece to measure accurately the orifice flow. In the figure below, a knee complete flanet shows a streamline for a bottom orifice. A related form of orifice is a sharp crested weir, commonly used for discharge measurement in open channels. The border mouthpiece is a reentrant slot in a large tank. The slot must be long enough such as the issuing jet is not affected by the presence of the wall. Denoting the jet thickness d on velocity at infinity v infinite, the entire flow field may be predicted using a conformal transformation. For a large reservoir, the contraction coefficient of a two-dimensional border mouthpiece is 0.5. In comparison, the contraction coefficient of a two-dimensional orifice is 0.61. Finally, Jean-Charles de Borda's name is engraved in the border of one of the four facets of the Eiffel Tower. His name is listed between those of Benoît Cléperon and Jean-Baptiste Fourier. A street in Paris is also named after him, Rue Borda, in the third arrondissement.